Welcome to Quick Learning. Today we are going to learn another exciting transaction code of SAP that will make your life very much easy in your daily routine of SAP and it will be very helpful for you in your business and in your all the uh, applications of SAP that is CS03 which is used to get a display of bomb material bomb is the bill of materials so if we want to get all the entries in a particular bomb for some particular material code cs03 transaction code is used again this video we have made this video only for your ease so that you can get very much success in your professional life in your businesses and wherever you are using sap so we will start without you know letting you wait more we will start by writing cs03 in main transaction tab for this sap we will press enter and now you will see that a small window has appeared in front of you first of all i would like to explain these few entries so that you know we can have a better understanding of this transaction on the top you can see this is display material bomb initial screen so this transaction as it has explained in its name as well it displays all the materials in a bomb so the first tab is the material what is the material it is any particular material code which has some other components inside it those materials will have the bomb for example there is a product that is made up of different raw materials so only that product will have some bomb and any raw material that is itself a single item will not have any bomb so we must have very much clear thought about what are the materials that can have some bomb okay for example when you make a juice you use sugar you use milk or you use any fruit so the juice itself is a material or a product and its bomb considers all the entities that you have used to make that juice so its bomb will will carry the sugar the quantity of sugar and the quantity of water the quantity of milk the quantity of fruit etc so this will this is the purpose of the bomb for example to get one liter of juice how much of the raw material you need how much sugar you need how much water you need how much milk you need and how much fruit you need so by giving this simple example i have tried to explain this particular meaning of the bomb and the materials that are considered in bomb so right now uh, we'll start by writing any material code here the next row is plant the plant is uh, any that particular warehouse or plant on which that particular material or product is defined and is it already in use or it's defined in its data bomb usage we have different options here we can select among uh, from these what is this is one for the production two for engineering design three is for universal four is for plant maintenance five for sales and distribution six for costing seven for empties eight for st stability study c and m so you can see we can enter from one to eight and then c and m as per our requirement and as per our material what type of material that we are going to look for its bomb and its uh, quantities this is the alternate native bomb this is an option we i can write anything here and down its validity for how much period i want to enter the uh, data so i can enter the date here and here is the quantity as well if i want to enter a particular quantity so that it can tell us that for this particular quantity i need the bomb of these materials 
for example for 5 k 5 liter of juice for 10 liter i can uh, write my required quantity here so in material if you know the material code very good for example i know this material code this is one material and i know the plant as well so i have entered this these things and i will enter one because one is for production so i will write three uh, entries here i will just press enter and it will show me all the available bombs for that particular material code for that particular product and in that particular plant so all these bombs are currently available in system you can see their validity period these are uh, arranged in a descending order the first one is the most updated one to further look into the detail of each bomb i will just write uh, press double click on that bomb and it will show me all the entries uh, in that bomb so just to make it you know a bit simple you will see here for that I will explain what is this this is a one bomb so this is the bomb of this product for this particular plant and it is showing me that this product is made up of these things plus right there the default default value was 1000 quantity so for 1000 quantity of this product 294300 I need these quantities of these raw materials I need this first quantity that is the component with this amount the other one with this amount this 535 with 6000 pieces 592 with 6000 this was this is the bomb this is the practically the bomb for 1000 pieces of that product 294300 material code so you can see that using this transaction i am able to get the details of uh, all the components inside a bomb and all the quantities that are required for that particular product or the material code so i'll come back so this is the way uh, if i know any material code myself then i can you know uh, just write the material code here and it will show me all the details of the bombs for that particular material code if I for example don't know the material code I can just search it down just by pressing that uh, symbol of a glass it will open a new window in front of me and I'll in double asterisk I will search for that material for example I write something like FNTA and it will show me all the materials that are available with this particular uh, uh, name with the description in it so you can see that uh, I will find out what is the relevant what is the relevant material code that I want for example in these I need the material code that is suitable for me for or for which I want to see the value is this one 194 and uh, uh, 375 194375 so for example i write i open this one or this one 194300 i press enter or the tick mark and this material code will appear here and i will enter the plant again simply i will write one here i will press enter and now it is showing me that this is not maintained in this plant so you can see I will write another one for example after searching it down I will press enter and now it is showing me for this different number 194375 these bombs are available in system and this the upper one is the most updated one similarly and it is the base quantity is 1000 that I was mentioning earlier the base quantity mentioned here is 1000 pieces for that particular material code or product so I just I will press double click on one and I will be able to see the components inside that particular material code so you can see here for these 1000 pieces of this product I these are the components that I need these seven eight ones and these are the quantities that I need for each one of these component to get 1000 pieces so I hope this video will be very helpful for you and we have tried to give you a complete understanding of the CS03 command that is used to display the materials the that is used to display all the bombs for a particular material code and all the details inside the bombs 
for the particular material code so i hope this will be very helpful for you in your professional life and you can you know learn and experience sap very easily for any question you can just write in the comments tab please like and share this video and please subscribe to our channel for today it's uh, done from my side until next video take care